Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we're playing Wreckfest and we're going to have a look at the latest weekly challenge which is this time attack here. So this time attack is at the Furwood Motor Centre, the time trial circuit. We are in the Boomer again and these are the tuning settings that I'm going to use for my attempts. Okay, let's see how we get on then. As you can see had a few goes already and my fastest time at the moment is up at the top right at 51.528 I don't think that's too shabby a time actually fastest time that anyone's done so far is just under 50 seconds which is uh, pretty good going let's see how we get on as always with these rally time trial type weekly challenges it's it's uh, it's quite a technical challenge with the with the barrels. It's all about learning the course, learning where the barrels are, and trying to get good fast lines. It's not a not a particularly long uh, long lap round here. Just coming round towards the finish now. With these last set of barrels around this left hand corner here, and through look to half decent time not quite as fast as my fastest uh, time okay let's have just one more go see if we can uh, do any better try and keep these corners tight if possible again I was slightly wide on that I do find that especially that once you've learnt the course and uh, you sort of know where to break, where to sell out, where where your best lines are. That almost it's, it's not driving slower as such, but it, it does seem that just going flat out and weaving in and out these barrels is not the fastest way. You, you're better off trying to get trying to get good accurate lines. That seems to be the way to uh, to get good time, even if that means you know feathering the accelerator a little bit or even braking slightly more than. You'd, you'd need to that was a good time again I think it was a 51 again yeah it's my fastest time so far 51.487 okay so now I've had a, a few goes and set some reasonable times I'm going to do a quick flyby of the course so straight off the course down here break quite late and try and get it in tight to those barrels I didn't actually get it too tight on my attempt if you keep it right through here because you're going to be swinging left in a bit you can do this either with a tiny bit of brake or just feathering the accelerator up through this section through the gap in the bells on the right but then you want to be aiming to the left a little bit because with this being a clockwise direction there's a lot of right hand corners so you come up to this right hand here take it as close to those bells on the right as you can drift to the left you can use a little bit of the uh, edge there you just got to watch that uh, that flag again with that one turning in get yourself lined up for these two sets of barrels here and then you want to be aiming over to the left starting to break for this right hand here through the set of barrels here and then aiming for the center gap here in between these barrels but again trying to pull the car over to the left now this corner here is seems to be quite a key one you need to break on that tarmac before it gets done to the dirt try and keep it tight and get onto the tarmac here if possible you can run wider onto the to the dirt wider but then you're struggling for grip and it's not as quick weaving through these last set of bubbles is not too difficult and then you've just got this last left hander to go where you can take as much curb as you want it doesn't you don't seem to get a penalty at all so yeah run run right over that curb for the most direct line straight through the finish and hopefully for a good time well that's my preview of the weekly challenge and I think I've got a little bit more time in there but hopefully you've enjoyed watching the video and see you soon